Hello, today I'll be answering you guys' questions for the 800 subs Q&A and I'll admit not the best turnout in terms of questions here. We only got questions from one person. So, I mean, the, the turnout for the 700 subs Q&A also wasn't great either, but with the 800 one here, definitely even worse. Honestly, kind of bad, but either way, it is what it is. Hopefully we get a better turnout for the 900, the 900 subs Q&A when that comes around, but again it is what it is but let's go ahead and dive into this um we got some questions from blink ps2 if emily armstrong wasn't the current vocalist for lincoln park who would you have liked to see take vocal duties a few of my choices would have been Derek wibley from some 41 dan marsala from story of the year and bobby amaru from saliva and for a female vocalist courtney laplante from spearbox would have been good also didn't think of Courtney. I thought I think that would, would have been an interesting choice. But personally, I'll admit I would much rather her just stick with Spirit Box. I think Spirit Box has a great thing going. And yeah, I think she has a great voice. And especially maybe, I honestly say probably one of the best voices of this current era, especially in the world of metalcore, this current era of metalcore. I mean, again, definitely has a really great voice also has a pretty good scream too but yeah I, I would much rather just stick with spirit box though but if if she would have would have joined lincoln park i think that would have been interesting and of course i would be excited but definitely would much prefer to just stick with spirit box um but yeah honestly when it comes to this i i probably i probably would have gone with either Derek wibley or from some 41 or michael bars from red Probably one of those two vocalists. I mean, I know Red, I know Linkin Park is an influence for on Red. Um, I remember reading about that somewhere, but yeah. I th honestly, I'd, I'd say Michael Barnes or Derek Wibley. I think either of the two would, would have been, been able to pull it off, uh, especially Michael Barnes from Red. I mean, definitely a killer vocalist. And if you haven't heard of Red, definitely check him out. Really good band, but yeah. Again, probably gonna have to go with either Derek Wibley or Michael Barnes from Red for sure. But I do think Emily Armstrong is doing a solid job. I, ha I do like the singles we've gotten so far. Uh, the MTS Machine I think is good, but I wouldn't say great or amazing, but still good, still solid I'd say. But I definitely like the second single much more. Heavy is the Crown. I think that song's honestly pretty good. But yeah, those are my answers for these questions for this Q and A. Um, Thank you, thank you, uh, Blake PS2 again for the questions. But yeah, thanks for watching. Please leave a comment, a like, subscribe. Have a nice day, and take care.